Hello everybody, my name is Sufyan and I work for Inclusion Europe. I want to tell you today about easy to read, what it is and why it's so important. A lot of people have difficulty understanding complex texts that affect their lives. For example, healthcare information or how to access their bank accounts. People need to understand this information to live their lives independently. Easy to read is information that people with intellectual disabilities are able to read and understand. Easy to read is important because it helps people to know what they are reading so that they can know their rights, make everyday decisions about their lives and understand what is being done about disability services and have a say in relevant policies. People with intellectual disability have a right to access information in easy to read. A good way of making an easy to read communication is to use simple words and short sentences. Explain any difficult words that need to be used. Use large text and pictures to help people understand and follow the text. But the most important rule is to make sure you always have a person with intellectual disabilities review and read the text. For more on how to make easy to read, see our guidelines on Inclusion Europe's website. It is important that people can understand big texts that affect their lives. One example of this can be done is the Istanbul Convention. This is a document about stopping violence against women and girls. Here you can see the easy to read Istanbul Convention. The whole convention is available in easy to read. There are two more things I would like to talk about when using easy to read. The first is that sometimes instead of organizations provide an easy to read description of the text, not an easy to read version of the full text. This is not what we want. As you can see from the Istanbul Convention, important texts can and should be provided in easy to read so that people with intellectual disability have equal access to information. My second thing is that just making an easy to read document is not enough, especially when you are creating policies about disability, the whole process has to be accessible. If you're hosting conferences, meetings, all communication about them should be an easy to read and the event itself should be made accessible to people with intellectual disabilities. For example, at the conference, there should be a clear schedule, enough time for people to participate, enough time for people to talk with their supporters. People should use simple language and speak slowly. This is what is needed so that people can know their rights, make decisions about their lives and understand what is being done about disability services and have a say in relevant policy. 